Someone's got the funniest position. One just guess who? Never, never start to argument. I wish I was better temperament. He's the wrong, but always right. Yeah? James is really right. That's so. He's done a bad luck. No one. Ah! But what is a cowboy? Yeah! Have you ever heard of a voodoo beetle? Well, confidentially, neither have we. But it seems that long ago, these little creatures were plentiful. But because of an inborn love for travel and adventure, the boodle beetle is now a rare little bug. The bug collector, or <clears throat> the entomologist, regards this little bug as a prize for his collection. Going somewhere, Sonny? I wouldn't be in too much of a hurry if I were you. There's danger lurking out in them woods. And you're just setting yourself for a heap of trouble. You know, there's not many of us boodles left. And it's just because too many of them have set out across that stream and never come back. And here you go, a setting your cap for the same medicine. Sit down, Sonny, and let me tell you a story. When I was a young pup and full of vinegar, <laughs> just like yourself, I had ideas of adventure, too. So, I packed my bag and said goodbye to my home. <laughs> I'm a little funny about this sentimental stuff. And set out for what was going to be the doggondest adventure. I'll have to admit, it was pretty fascinating at first. Cowboy. Ha, ha. Well, yeah, yeah. This is about right. Huh. Ah, fooey. I give up. Well, I guess I must have walked hundreds of miles that first day. I was just picking them up and laying them down. I just didn't feel up to it. So I thought I'd lay down for a little shut-eye and tackle it in the morning. Suddenly, I had the feeling I wasn't alone. And there, on top of the mountain, I saw a most amazing thing. Well, being a curious little fellow, I decided to investigate. And there it was. A, a silly monster, cowboy. Millions of feet high. I sneaked out to get a better look, and suddenly, it moved. Huh? And two hideous eyes glared at me. A little beetle. It's him. A boy. I got him. I got him. <laughs> Come on, small fry. It's going to lose any time. <laughs> oh, no, you don't, silly fry. I'm, no, no, I'm Sheriff Woody. I'll get you, you little varmint! Get shorty. Yeah. 
In you go, little fella. Safe and sound. So there I was, headed for I don't know what. It was simply terrifying. I tried again and again to escape, but it was no use. <laughs> if only I had listened to Mama. Just think of it. A famous Professor Cowboy. Oh boy. I just run up. <laughs> the door opened, and there he was. Suddenly I realized that this was my last chance. It was now or never. He's gone! He's gone! Silly dog on varmint go. Well, I'm sure I Woody. One happy little bug. And do you think I cared what folks thought about the sentimental stuff? No, sirree. So you see, Sonny, home isn't such a bad place after all. <laughs> Just thinking. For all I know, that monster may be that silly cowboy. Yet. Yet. I'll get that beetle if it's the last thing I do.